Ricardo Montaner's daughter, Eva Luna, confessed during a recent podcast that she decided to remain a virgin until marriage when she was only 15 years old. And this decision obviously had a huge impact on her husband. Well, I can imagine. The 22 year old <laughs> singer and actress said, and I quote, Camilo was the best man in the world. For him, he had to suffer. But I am talking about this to say that it is very important to pay attention to what one wants to experience. Yeah. I mean, that makes sense. And, Cloud, let me actually tell you that many have actually criticized her for talking so openly about it and for her decision. But she's not actually the only celeb who has chosen this path. I don't know if you guys know, but Victoria's secret angel, Adriana Lima, confessed in 2008 that she, too, was waiting until marriage. And for her, the fact that her, her significant other respected the decision was a demonstration of love. Back then, she said, and I quote, he needs to respect me because it is my choice. If they don't respect that, it means they don't love me. So now my question to you all is, what do you guys think about this? Oh, man. I like this topic. Listen, I love this topic. <laughs> listen. If there's, like, there's absolutely no question in that it is a demonstration of love. Of course, it's a huge demonstration of love. Like, that's clear. That's one thing. Mm -hmm. But I will say that I feel like a lot of people do that do this. Like, I'm all for it. If you can do it, then God bless. Clearly, <laughs> best of luck. So, but I feel like a lot of people do this thinking that because you do that, then you're going to have a forever after. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ever, forever after. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But then that's the thing, yeah. that if you're doing it because of that, then I was doing all my research in not only celebrities, but like a lot of people. Actually, I know a lot of people that have done that and just like have saved themselves like for marriage. And the thing is, that doesn't mean that you're going to stay with that person yeah, no, forever. And not. most of them, mm -hmm. if not, not all of them, but most of them at this point in life are already divorced or like yeah. separated or are just not together anymore. Yeah, yeah, So it's absolutely. like, do it, but for what are you doing? It? Right, you know what right. I mean? Without a doubt. Yeah. It, it's definitely not totally. going to be something that, you know, will guarantee that your marriage is going to be exactly. fantastic for sure. Totally. You know, and I, I do have to applaud Eva Luna here because there's a lot of people, you know, that want to wait until marriage. And, you know, she just happens to be one of them. And a lot of people do it for different reasons. It could be religious reasons. It could be other reasons. So good for her, mm -hmm. you know, for representing sort of, you know, that, that those people that want to wait. I will say, Eva Luna is not the only celebrity nope. to do this. I don't know if you guys remember, one of the biggest uh, celebs to, to you know, mention that she was going to wait until marriage was Britney Spears. Britney yeah, Spears yeah. Um, right. had, had come out saying that she was a virgin. <laughs> the 90s. And then the problem, <laughs> right, the problem with that as a celebrity is that you release a single or you make a movie or whatever it is, and all anyone wants to find out is, are you still a virgin, you know? And it's and it just right, it's really uncomfortable right. to have to discuss that. It turns out, by the way, that, you know, a couple of years later, Britney did reveal that she ended up having sex with Justin Timberlake. Timberlake. Uh -huh. Yeah, but the worst part is, is that her mom, Lynn, had uh, released a book that actually revealed that Britney lost her virginity at 14 to a football player. What? And I'm just like, wait a minute, that. why are we going into this? Why is my mom discussing this? Why? It, there, there's just, it's so weird. Like, it's just a big discussion there to be had. Yeah. But again, it's uncomfortable. It's just but uncomfortable. It's, a, it's an uncomfortable discussion that needs to be had, I think. I think it, we should be able to talk about this openly. And I respect it from sure. Eva Luna, Britney Spears, or Mama Spears. I will say my opinion behind this is, I feel like you should know your partner in all its entirety before you mm -hmm. commit to forever with them. You want to know what you got to work so, with, So you basically know? do it, is I what you're saying. I mean, that's me. But okay. I think you should do it with the right age and everything's comfortable and that you're comfortable. You know, you just, it right. should be done when you're confident in it, not just because, hey, I'm with somebody I need to. No, it's, 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 you, it's a mutual thing that needs to be understood. Agree. And I just got to say something, too, I, because if you're a public person and then you want to say that you're going to be a virgin forever, but then you kind of don't know, maybe don't say it out loud like, yes, I'm going to be a virgin, because then it happens like with Britney, you know, it was like, yeah, she was totally for virginity. She was asked about that all the time. And then she was like, yeah, you know what? I don't think so. Yeah. So that happens. And that's kind of what happened with the Jonas Brothers. Yeah. I don't know if you remember circa 2008. That they all had purity rings and they were like all about being virgins forever and love. And then, you know, the only one who actually went through with it was Kevin. But Nick and Joe were like, yeah, I, I like this baby, but I'm taking this off and putting it somewhere else and then go enjoy life a little bit more. So, you know, it happens in every place. There's people who want to do it, people who don't want to do it. There's different reasons why they want to. Let me tell you something. 
quarantine for single peeps has been hard. So I have to get those, one of those rings, baby, because after this, it's going to be like, you know what? I'm going to start giving interviews and be like, you know, I'm going to take you through my journey. No, but <laughs> yeah, it's been hard. You guys. I know. Alix is wearing, or we're all wearing, though, the purity ring, the purity Nas. necklace, the purity bandana, the purity right. toe ring, right. the purity everything. Nas is extra glowing during this quarantine, let me just say. Nas, that's just mean. That's just mean. But, you know. Oh it's, it's, it's a conversation always that we're always going to have and then we're always going to have religious reasons or, you know, whatever reasons you have. But I am with Nas saying that if you're going to go all the way with someone for life, you have to be, like, kind of in the know of what's going on. Gentlemen, gentlemen, no, there you yeah. have it. You heard it straight from Malik. <laughs> we forgot to say one thing. What? What actually is, like, the definition of being a virgin? Because There's loopholes, Cloud. There's loopholes. Get it? But, like, what does that mean exactly? Because, like, you can do so many things and still be a virgin. We get it, exactly. Claudia. Yeah. We get it. <laughs> we'll talk about that. Just throw that out there. Ustedes ya saben que acá en Latinx Now les tenemos todos los news de absolutamente todos los artistas Latinxers y los que no también. That's right. Osuna, Bad Bunny, Anuel, hasta Sofía Vergara makes an appearance every once in a while. Quieren estar súper enterados de todos ellos y más. Ya saben, suscríbanse. That's it. Subscribe. Go now, por favor. Bye.